tip I got for you guys out there that hunt tree stands. We're only about about 15 to 6, about 16 to 20 feet up, not too high. But um, what you want to do is when you're sitting kind of low to the ground, you always want to take you some wind checker out. And with wind checker, you can always make sure that wind is going right. And as you can see, it's going towards the field there. Um, we expect the deer to come off to the side here and come and get a drink of water, so that's pretty okay. They're going to be coming from behind us, um, and these deer are going to be working from the, the, the left side here. But uh, always you want to take some wind checker out and check that wind. As you can see right now, it's, it's pretty much going that way. But it's pretty hard, but it's always a special tip. Take your wind checker. It'll make a big difference in your hunt. Good night. He's done. He's done. That's a big bug. He's in going. Well, one thing I want to tell you guys, I think is a real good tip is you always kind of want to learn how to shoot sitting down. It makes a difference, okay? It makes a big difference and that's to be able to shoot while you sit down because you might not always be able to stand up on that deer especially uh, if you got a buck coming in he's very very sensitive so what I'm going to do here is show you guys how to shoot out of the stand while you're sitting down stand doesn't always mean you're standing up That is a perfect kill shot. A perfect kill shot. It could, I couldn't ask for more. But that's what you want to do. It's always practice how you stand before and even after season. After of shooting while you're sitting down and standing up out of the stand. Just do many different, many different differences on how you shoot because it's going to make a difference when you're shooting in the stand. But that's for me and the boys here at Addiction to the Wild. Okay. 
try and get a head shot here. Well, as I said, uh, we have a little bit of a different strategy here today when we're doing this. Um, It'll give us some coverage on this ground. And uh, when you're doing this, you want to be using as much uh, coverage as you can with the blend in. That's how you can get your shot off. That's going to be a pretty good shot. Got a nice little bill here, and um, she came in at 25 yards, gave me a quarter and a way shot, and uh, put a nice shot on her. And um, she didn't go too far, maybe about, about 40, 50 yards. And um, this has been a great hunt, but I tell you guys, this is some of the key parts is to get out there and, and scout, scout, scout. We scouted and seen this deer. And we got another deer over here um, that we came out and seen not too long ago, maybe about a week ago, came out and scouted. 
and found some a good area and put the stand up and you put it up when when it's raining, you know, and those little things like that will pay off. So we're gonna get this girl a little, a little uh, done up and get her processed and and uh, have a good season. But I want this to happen for all of you guys out there.